Welcome to Vesterheim, the National Norwegian American Museum and Folk Art School. Since 1967, Vesterheim Folk Art School has been building community by passing the rich history of folk art from the hands of one generation to the next. We've produced this program to share with you and hope it inspires your creativity. Hi, I'm Andrew Ellingson, one of the Education Program Coordinators at Vesterheim Folk Art School. And I'm Jenny Grouse, one of the co-directors of the Nordic Dancers and Orchestra in Decora. We are so excited to be sharing these dances with you. Support for this programming is provided by the American Scandinavian Foundation. The dance we're going to be sharing today is Riel fra Landvik. And Riel is one of the traditional dances in Norway, and Landvik is a place in southern Norway. And I have to say, our dancers learned about this a few years back when another dance group from Norway came and taught our dances this particular dance. And I think that's exciting because the way that people learn these social dances were by learning them from people from the next communities over. So we're kind of carrying on that tradition. That's fantastic. You'll notice as you're watching the directions to this dance that it looks so simple at the beginning because everybody's <laughs> doing the same thing and then all of a sudden it gets so complicated. And it's because instead of everybody doing the same thing at the same time, this one happens in a three-part round or canon where each group is doing something different. We hope you enjoy. The formation for this dance is a circle of couples or trios. In the first section of the dance, we stand in place and clap our hands. Let's try it. Next, we go forward and back. Watch how the dancers begin on the left and go left, right, left, and hop with the right knee up, then step right, left, right, hop back into their place. They clap on each of the hops. Here's what it looks like with the full group of dancers. The last section of the dance is galloping eight to the left and then eight back to the right, holding hands with your partner or trio. What makes this dance so interesting is that all three of the sections are happening at the same time. These dancers are clapping in place first. These dancers are going in and out first. And these dancers are galloping first. Here's what it looks like when all three steps are happening at the same time. After you clap, you go in and out. After you go in and out, you gallop. After you gallop, you clap your hands. Let's try the second chunk of the dance. Notice how each dancer is doing something different than before. At this point, you've done two of the three steps and only have one section left to perform. Let's try the last section of the dance. Here's the full dance accompanied by a recording of the entire Nordic Dance Orchestra. <laughs> <laughs> 